don't make this mistake in React. So over here in our component, we have a ref. It is an input ref. So it goes here at the bottom on this input tag over here. And then we have this use effect over here that will try to focus the ref on initial mount of the component. Now, this is bad and it's bad for two reasons. First of all, there's a bug over here, right? Because the way we have it currently, this use effect here is going to run on mount on the initial render of the component. But since show here is false, this input ref is actually not going to be there on that first render, right? Until we change it to true. And so this use effect over here, the actual code that will focus the input is not going to run. Now we could fix the problem by just coming here and adding show to our actual dependency array of the use effect. And that will fix the problem because now this is going to run every single time the show changes, but this is still not the correct way to do things. And there is a better way. Instead, a better solution is to get rid of the use effect, get rid of the use ref, and then create here a function for the ref that will take in the element that's optional. And then if we have an element, we're going to call element.focus and then pass that function to the ref because in React, we can do that. We can pass functions to refs. And now with this code, if you look at it, what we've essentially done is now we no longer care how this input element actually gets rendered, right? If it's because of the show property being true or another property, we just don't care anymore because we provided a function to the ref through this input ref. This function is going to get called whenever this input is going to get rendered. And that's also going to call or focus call here, which is exactly what we want. And this is a better solution.